Hi, I'm TJ Styles with TJ Brutal Customs, and today we're going to be talking about our dual carb velocity stacks for your Honda Shadow. When it comes to performance, one of the first things you should look at is your intake. If you're looking to get a little more power out of your Honda Shadow, there's a couple ways to accomplish this. One of those ways is by adding velocity stacks to your intake. You remove all the stock components and you install these. A velocity stack increases the velocity of air coming into your carburetor without reducing the volume. Also reduces the amount of turbulence inside the venturi of the carburetor. By doing this, you allow a perfectly metered mixture of fuel and air to be delivered to your motor for the best possible performance. The dual carb velocity stacks come in a multitude of finishes. Right here I have a polished aluminum set. They also come in raw aluminum, bead blasted, as well as the same type of finishes in brass. They all include a small brass filtration screen, which is replaceable and you can get replacements on the side as well. They attach via three set screws on the sides and it's best to install these with the carbs already on the bike. To install the velocity stacks, you'll want to remove your entire stock intake components, including the snorkels which attach to the carburetor throat. First, slide on the filtration screen onto the carburetor. Next, press the stack over the screen, ensuring an even fit. From there, all you have to do is tighten the set screws and you're ready to roll. Some people's common concerns with velocity stacks are, is water going to get in my bike? Is my bike going to suck in a bunch of crap and ruin the motor? Absolutely not. You can ride with your velocity stacks in all weather and you can go down dusty roads for miles and you'll be fine. The filtration screen will not let anything big enough to do any harm to your motor inside your intake. So you don't have to worry about that. As with any filtration screen, eventually you will want to replace them. Keep an eye on them for any wear, any holes, or any tears in that screen. You can find replacement screens on shoptjbc.com. If you do decide to use velocity stacks on your bike, you will need to rejet your carburetors. You can find our performance tuning kit on the website as well. These dual carb velocity stacks will fit the VT600, VT750 models, which are dual carb, the VT500s and some VT700s. If you have questions about fitment, don't hesitate to reach out to us through our contact page. I'd be happy to answer any questions for you. When you get your dual carb velocity stacks, you'll get two stacks, two screens, and a set of little stainless set screws to attach the stacks to your carburetor. You can find replacements on shoptjbc.com.